Hey guys, uh, we're here in a, in a Thai supermarket. Hello. Because we're trying to, you know, make a little video on how we get, you know, like these regular groceries, the ones you don't find in the market or in a convenience store. And pretty much we think we found a gold mine. That's a really big uh, supermarket. It's actually, it's more than a supermarket, it looks like it. And you have a, you have bicycles here. You have a luggage here, you have toys for children, all kinds of things. It's incredible. <laughs> you know, this is like a lotus and I do not... I know these little lotus here. They have lotus like, not like 7-Eleven, but they have quite a few. But this one is a bit bigger, I would say. Wouldn't you agree? <laughs> It's amazing. I've never seen this actually. Uh, wow. They have all kinds of things, you know, like yeah, like toys, they have helmets, they have baby baby seats, they have uh, you know what not like eating to uh, tools to work on on stuff, you know. And brooms, whatever, uh, tennis rackets, bulbs, containers, big containers. They have uh, fans here, towels. You, know, you, you cannot imagine, you know, ironing boards, there are TVs in the back there, but yeah, well, let's go get some groceries, you know. It's kind of like, uh, like, I want to show you, you know, where, where we go to buy stuff that we don't find in the market or in a convenience store like 7-Eleven or Lotus, but this is a Lotus. Uh, there's also lots of clo uh, clothing sections, big, big clothing sections, actually. And there's, uh, there's a... Uh, for beds and and there's there's pans there is walks there is rice cookers there is uh, these pillows with a bear on it or different bears on it there's even a flipping bed can you imagine that they're selling this bed in a supermarket you know this for the ladies for the underwear and yeah whatever gardens garden chairs another bed you know I went to the supermarket bought a bed honey you know, all kinds of things. It's not funny. Uh, uh, there's uh, diapers. Well, I actually might go by the diaper section after them. Oh, still good. Anyway, so what I want to show you, like things we don't find that we need, or well, we want sometimes. So this is soy milk of found. What you don't find in the small ones is these liters, but you find them here. I'll, I'll grab a couple of those and a couple of small ones. Let's get a couple. I mean, the, the regular uh, liter ones, you know, like for cooking, for oats, or for, for uh, you know, all kinds of things that you don't want to, you know, uh, pop open a small one, you know. And the small ones that the kids love them for, for breakfast. And the small one for the small kid, right? They have a big section of milk and soy milk. They have actually have more soy milk than they have milk, which is, you know, like not usually in, in lots of countries you don't find soy milk at all. Or when if 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 you find them, it's like very just a few a little selection. Uh, there's oats. So I'll buy oats. We love oats sometimes. You know, like have have something really healthy for you. And so I'll buy a couple of these beer as well but I'm good with beer Heineken oh, what is this here it's very difficult to steer this uh, stroller with the, with the little one and with the stuff of course I cannot can I have, a, have, a, have a trolley because uh, I have the, uh, the stroller and I want to leave the stroller outside uh, here's coffee oh, there's condensed milk there's different kinds of coffee just give a little coffee a little small coffee Right. Let's support the country, the home country, right? <laughs> Not use that done, but I don't care. And of course, there is lots of noodles and potato chips. Uh, what kinds? All kinds of chips. But yeah, this is stuff I get from every shop in, in town. I don't have to go to a supermarket. I actually went to buy a new battery for my camera because. That was the big, the biggest problem. Uh, so, uh, and I saw this gigantic supermarket, uh, and I figured, yeah, let's go, let's go for that one. 
found is just regular flour, you know, like wheat flour. So I, I'm, I'm hopeful that I'll find it here at the supermarket. Because, uh, yeah, you'll find rice flour on the market or in the, in the convenience store, but I never find wheat flour. Maybe we want to make some, some pancakes sometimes, you know, so I'd be like, that's, that's like that breakfast stuff. If, when we have an apartment, it's nice to, to, to just, you know, stay in and have a, have a quiet breakfast at home. So then it's actually oats or toast or, or, or maybe pancakes sometimes, you know, so it'd be cool if I find it. Not sure. With all the frozen section. Just a regular supermarket, right? Ice cream, yeah. Maybe I'll buy some some cheese. Don't have enough cheese with me. Get some cheese and that. Surprised to see uh, that they have an open wine section. You know, not like super cheap wine because uh, they don't make it here. Uh, they're all important. But you know, like after. Basically, many countries uh, where they don't have that, they do have that here. That's a, that's a full alcohol section. I mean, I don't even need alcohol, I'm just passing it. But maybe some of you are interested, you know. This is what a Thai supermarket, you know, looks like. Oh, right. so there's even, even liquor. Yeah, so in, in Malaysia, that would not be like that. I think not in India either, or of course not Pakistan, or you know, lots of places actually where some some places like completely banned or like like hidden, but you know, like open like this. This is like in Europe, you know, like alcohol in every supermarket. Uh, although, yeah, this is diff it's a it's a change. Uh, it's a, it's a difference in in cost. So alcohol is much cheaper in 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 Europe actually. It's funny if you think that like everything is more expensive in Europe, right? Not the alcohol. Well, alcohol is more expensive in Malaysia, and yeah, cheaper here, but still, it'd be a lot cheaper in Europe. I've not found uh, any any flour. Come on, guys! <laughs> this is like a market, cool. like a regular Thai market, but it's a supermarket. Of course, you got lots of rice here. Yeah, yeah, this is all rice, different rice. Eggs, different eggs. They even have durian here. I can smell it. Oh wow. Oh wow, it's quite pricey. I, I, I do want to make a, a durian video too, but I'm not sure if I can. Lots of noodles here. Eggs. Right, fresh produce. But yeah, fresh, fresh produce I get from the market. You know, like... Um, supporting the local marketeers. So it's nice to see, you know, you can get everything you want. Uh, lots of tofu, lots of, there's fish, fresh fish even, you know. Fresh meat product. But no flour, dude, I want some flour. I want to make some pancakes. <laughs> it seems ridiculous, isn't it? Huh? You want some pancakes? Maybe. <laughs> You'll probably ask yourself why I'm filming so badly. It's because I'm not holding my my stick and I'm trying to hide the camera because actually in every single supermarket video I made, yeah, I can film openly, in every sim single supermarket I made, I've been stopped. In, in pretty much every country. There was in Morocco, there was in India, there was in Pakistan, there was lots of places. Someone will come up to me and say, dude, you cannot film here. But here, Nobody seems to care. I could even hold my old soft selfie stick. But I still don't have I still don't have my my flower. I want flower. <laughs> and actually I asked the guy and I did it on my, my Google Translator. I, I wrote flower, wheat flower, and I wrote flower like flower, like you know, uh, the plants and then he, he looked at me, he said like, dude, there, there are no flowers. <laughs> <laughs> so then, I, then he, he spoke pretty good, he spoke really good English, that's funny actually. And yeah, he directed me here and he may not have understood me or maybe I just not found it yet. Pretty sure I will, but I'll let you know. There's lots of things, right? Lots of, there's a super aisle full of oil, soy sauce, tomato ketchup, fish sauce, 
all kinds of sauces, you know, there's lots of things. And then I find the flour. The only thing that moonshine and lemongrass really needs is flour. I know, this is salt, dude. <laughs> Even if Himalaya salt, Himalaya salt, but no flour. Sugar, sugar, is it sugar? Yeah, this is white sugar. That's, that's the opposite of salt, right? Anyway, so there's some flour here. It's a flour. They got even more flour than Switzerland. Which one do I take? Ah, oh, they even have pancake flours. Flour. I mean, they're not taking that one. Well, anyway, let's get let's get just a regular one. Cake flour will be good. Take that. Oh, one should be okay. Alrighty, not too bad, not too shabby. I achieved what I wanted to. I mean, I did show you the supermarket more or less, right? A bit shaky, a bit insecure, and with the goal of getting flour, oats, and soy milk. That's all we need. Now, actually, you know, we all we always actually uh, need eat uh, local food. But you know, have you know, have the one or other day or one or other meal that is an exception, and then you know, you'd like to have a regular whatever, you know, whatever it is that you dream of, right? I like this, and you have the nice Thai music in the back. Alrighty, you know what a what a Thai supermarket looks like, right? I always wondered. I have. Actually, I've not been not been in a big big supermarket in Thailand like this. Only always always in these uh, convenience stores. Pretty cocky, you know. I with the camera. I just you know hold it openly. <laughs> not afraid to be caught anywhere. Anyway, so I'm leaving anyway. So what are they gonna do? Confiscate my camera? Nah, they're not. Exactly nothing. I'm showing you guys the Thai supermarket, the ultimate experience. <laughs> ah, going in circles. The great supermarket. I wanna, I wanna spend all my days here. The supermarket in Thailand. It's nice and fresh, actually. Nice and cool. I like it. Is it? Yeah. We're saying goodbye, right? Bye bye. <laughs> yes, yes. These guys again. Anyway, yeah, take good care and see you in my next video. Bye bye. By the way, we'll be soon in another country because we're getting ready to be leaving the country very soon. Uh, you'll find out where we'll go very soon. Bye bye. By the way, you know, just like in Europe, very modern. It's not like we have to drag the stuff. The, the, this actually moves forward to the cashier and you hand them money and uh, you do food and you're all good, right? <laughs> Guys, yeah, that was it. That was my little supermarket video. Once you leave here, you have all kinds of other shops as well. Yeah, this is like a mall. Yeah, these big, big supermarkets. Well, I have not seen many, but I just, you know, thought you might want to see this too. Yeah, I did say, I did make my outro already, right? But kind of like, feels like you need to see this as well. There's a butter as well. Lots of t-shirts, banks, different banks actually. Jeans, it's another bank, lots of banks <laughs> in, in the compound. Yeah, it's like a mall. It's not like, because you're here in Bangkok, you know about malls, right? So there's great malls. And this being, a small mall, a supermarket, like like a supporting act, right? Anyway, guys, uh, sorry to, uh, this is actually, and there's a Mr. DUY as well, which I know from, from Malaysia. I have it here too, very funny. It's the DIY on the, on the third floor, so I'm not gonna go up there, but yeah, you're gonna have to take my word for it. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Anyway, and some, some fresh produce outside the supermarket and a KFC. They have everything you could think of, right? And even even some ice cream parlors. Oh wow, it's Vincent. The fun does not stop. If you wanna 
buy more things while you come from the supermarket. You can buy more things on the way out of the supermarket or before you go into the supermarket, which is like in inconvenient, right? Because you could buy it at the supermarket. Anyway, there's lots of electronics as well and socks and hats and the McDonald's, of course, and McDonald's and the Chester's. I don't even never even heard of Chester's, but I'm sure it's good. And there's a Dairy Queen and a Fuji and, you know, there's lots of things. Ah. There's a bakery. Yeah. Okay, guys. Uh, uh, Fuji, this is a Japanese restaurant. So if, you, if, you, if you're here buying stuff and you're feeling like Japanese food, you can go. And the Hachiban ramen as well. Anyway, okay. I'm shutting up now. Bye-bye, guys.